Ten-year-old boy is arrested in Florida. What for? Let me tell you. Florida cops release a mugshot of a ten-year-old boy. They cuffed and prepped and walked after he jokingly texted a friend that he had bought four assault rifles. The text read, I scammed my friend and included a Google image of money according to his arrest report. I bought this, he added a few seconds later. It included an image of four assault rifles. Then he stated, get ready for Water Day, referencing to a recent school-sponsored event in which students participate in water activities like playing in sprinklers. He described wads of cash to get ready to commit a mass shooting. Marcinio said of the text during a W Radio interview Monday, adding, we don't wait one second. We investigate every threat as if it's real. He also warned anyone who attempts the school shooting, you don't get to come into one of the schools in my county and present deadly force because we meet deadly force with delay force without one second, without hesitation. Think again. You can go on and read the rest. It is the second time a fake threat has rocked the community of violence. He says he also holds the fifth grader's parents accountable for the threat as he would with the parents of any child who threatens a massacre. No charges have been filed against Marquez's parents as there are no applicable ones for them. He's also confirmed that the 10-year-old has no prior criminal history. It is unclear if he had a history of mental illness. They publicly slammed the boy on Facebook, acting like a little delinquent, and said he was now experiencing real consequences. Making sure our children are safe is paramount. We'll have law and order in our school. My team did not hesitate not one second, not one second to investigate this threat. Lee County will have an order. Let me know in the comments what your, com your feelings are about this. Did police officers do the right thing? Or do you feel they were a bit much? I would like to know what your thoughts are. Thank you.